Hey guys, I'm Tess Pride and welcome to my third and final review on the Toddler Stuff Pack. We're going to be going over all the gameplay features in this one. We're going to play all the objects and set up a play date with so many toddlers. Like, it's ridiculous. <laughs> so, first I figured we'd just, uh, before we invite a lot of people over, I would go and play around. I did set up some inside and some outside, so I wanted to prove that some of the outside stuff could still be used uh, indoors. So, okay, so with this, you can have your parents help them. So we want to have help the toddler climb. Can we not? I want. Okay, you can either have them climb on their own or help toddler climb. I guess she's the only one we can help climb, so we're going to do that. Just to go ahead and jump things right off. Uh, while she's doing that, he can they can actually come play dolls here. Actually, he can come play dolls and then he can come uh, use the toy chest. It looks like it just gives the same toys as always, but we're just going to go ahead and do that. Okay, so it looks like they're going to use the outdoor one. I specifically told them not to use that one. Where are they? Oh no, there they are. There they are. Okay, they're coming to the right one. Sometimes they'll do that with objects, like if there's more than one, it'll just automatically tell it to get to the other one. It's really weird. But first you have to help them climb. And then... This is so cute. Is she going to slide around? I think she's just going to sit up there until we help her slide. Oh, and she's automatically going to do it just because you press time. Oh, isn't that cute? Okay. So, but they can also do it on their own if they really want to. Like, I think she's putting down so she can... Now come, if she presses climb, she'll just sit at the top, but if you press slide, she'll automatically do both at once. Floopy! What is I wish all the adults would get out of here. <laughs> and then she just goes and like slides on her own. And you probably tell they're playing with the toys and like all the imaginations coming up. Speaking of imagination skill, that's the next thing I want to show off with these play around things. Uh, we'll have her come play on this one. She has the highest imagination skill, so she'll have the most unlocked. So you can come to make believe, and you can do make believe pirate shipwreck or make believe spaceport. So I'm going to have her come do that one, this one, and I could have him, all I'm going to have him do is crawl through because he doesn't have quite a high enough imagination skill. Same with him. So I'm going to have both of them come crawl through over here while she's make-believe, playing make-believe. And there's some really cool stuff with make-believe. It shows a bunch of animations. It would... Hurry up, toddlers walk oh so slowly. But you can see like there it's like having a ton of animations and stuff. That's what the rocket ship one looks like. And when the adults come to play, like they have a spaceship helmet on. Which is really cute. But now I want her to make believe with a pirate ship. Let's have her switch to the pirate ship. 
So when the adult is not playing with her on this one, but when uh, the adult does, she has like a pirate ship hat on and does that. Actually, I can probably have him come do that. But as you uh, switch to the parents, they can't see in the, any of the imagination stuff. It's only the toddlers can see it. Like, any toddler can see it. It's just... She has a pirate ship, a pirate ship, a pirate head on. And it looks like that's all there is to that. I believe he is coming through and crawling through. And he comes through and crawls on the tunnels and goes through all the tunnels. I believe if you have the equipment right around, you he will play with other ones. So I think if you press slide. Oh, we're about to have, like, so many toddlers over, like, super late. Oops. Yeah, they'll just, like, automatically, because she's playing Imagination on that one, and then she's going to play Imagination on that one. So, before you get too late, I'm going to go ahead and start gathering. So, pretty much what this does is a parent who knows a bunch of toddlers, which I had her go around and meet so many toddlers. So, we should have plenty of toddlers to do this with. We can go, there's a new social event, and it's a play date, and it, you can, as long as the adult knows some toddlers, they can invite them to there, and then when you invite the toddlers, it automatically brings their caregivers with them, so you're not having to, like, watch out after a bunch of toddlers. Each toddler will have their, uh, certain caregiver to care to. So, let's... Host caregiver will have all three of them be the host. Host toddler will be have them be these three. And guest toddler, let's have them do as many toddlers as we can fit here. Aw, oh, there's not that many. Okay, so I'm going to invite some from each house. Um, let's see, let's do with her him. I guess I'll just have to pick out my favorite. I want to... We already have a superhero outfit, so... Um... Yeah, that'll do. I just wanted to make sure to have as many caregivers over as we could. And we will have it at our residence. So, we need to eat some food. So I'll have him come grill up some food on the new grill. Um, let's grill... Let's grill hamburgers and I'll have his wife grill hot dogs so we have plenty of food because we did have invite quite a few people over and you can see the caregivers are obviously coming as well um it looks like she's just coming up to watch tv with the rest of the adults but it works so let's see have sam some stance at the same time i don't know if we'll do that play with a toddler um, so she can come. Seriously? Seriously, did you have to start a fire right now? Okay, so we are back. So maybe we shouldn't make food and follow the events. Let's just go and play with, uh, all this stuff. Okay. So now he has make-believe. Okay, that's cool. So let's have them come... You know, let's play in the ball pit inside so we can see a little bit better. Um, I think we can make a group with all the... Or do we have to know? Where is he? Do we have to know all the toddlers to make a group with them? Probably. Let's talk to Stranger. Because they, they are supposed to make friends while they're here. And now all the kids are crying because there was a fire. Great! You know, there's a gate right there you could have used. If you're going to go around this way, let's just... Let's meet this one because that means this one's closest. Talk to Stranger. So that guy just totally jacked our horrible talk. Uh... 
horrible toss. Horrible grill. How rude. Okay, let's see. Um, you... Where's your brother? You're going to play the dollhouse. He really likes that dollhouse today. I think we can make a group. Action. Add to group. Okay, we can't form a group, but we can add to group. Okay, well, let's at least add her brothers to the group, and then we'll have them all go... Uh, well, I guess it's not a group action to play play in the ball pit together. That's really weird. Everything else is a group action. Play in the ball pit. So let's have these kids come play in the ball pit because that's super cute. I think more than one person can do it at once, I'm pretty sure. Um, you come play in the ball pit as well. Come on. Uh, he's kind of having fun with this little one. Let's babble. Why? Hey, did any of them go play in the ball pit? Oh, she did. Oh, this is so cute. Is that not like the cutest thing ever? Just like she is so happy to be in that ball pit. I actually never been in a ball pit in my life, but I hear it's like super fun, especially when you're little. Or it can be really disgusting when you find like a diaper in there. I'm glad they didn't include that in this game. So yeah, that's pretty much it. Um, I would try to follow the procedures, but I'm really scared that they would like not work but they can come sit in this um they can also i think anyone can come sit on those pillows i found in her room where did they go I, the pillows are right there oh well, well the pillows they can sit on i was showing you in my build review yeah they they more than one can play at a time right there's two right here playing in it. Super cute. And also, some of these toddlers, like this one, was used in like The Sims for uh, review. Why can't I think of words today? Like I'm just struggling. I'm struggling, but I like the fact that I set these two next to each other, and they're going back and forth between these two without having to say anything. That's pretty much it. That's pretty much everything that came with the new thing. I have put another review out. Um, one for Crazy Sim, which was also a slash first reaction. And then another one where er, I was going all over all the build items that you see here and out there. Mainly out here. So anyways guys, thank you so much for watching, um, this pack is $10 American dollars, I always got it on Origin, and I think if you are looking to expand your gameplay with toddlers, that this is a great way to do it. So thank you so much for watching, make sure to like, subscribe, and do all this awesome stuff, because you guys are awesome people, and I'll see you next time. Alright, bye!